Welcome back. Hello everyone. Today we're going to make some damsel juice. Firstly, we are going to add some cinnamon and then we are going to add to this some clove and I am going to also add some bay leaf and also some nutmeg. Then I am going to fill the pot with water. Now normally this process is when you are going to make red cherries and you would just blanch the cherry to remove some of that acidic flavor so instead of throwing away that water because i am going to make some cherries so, I'm, so this is a two-in-one type of video so instead of throwing away the water i'm going to use the water to make some juice and listen to me with all those spices in there mm, this juice was amazingly wonderful so going back to what we are doing here filling the pot with water i'm going to bring that to a boil and once it has come to a boil we're going to let that sit boiling for at least 20 minutes because i'm trying to remove as much bitterness as possible click the bell for new video so i let this sit boiling on a low fire for 20 minutes and now i am going to strain the water out and get started with my juice so once i have removed the water from the cherry that cool for a bit i am going to place some in a jar and this i am going to use a syrup so let's get into making the syrup first So I am going to sweeten this raw water that we just extracted from the damsel. I am going to sweeten it really really sweet and I am going to put that aside. So all you will do with this is just when you are ready add some water to this and you don't have to add anything else to it. And then I am going to actually use the unsweetened water, add some water to it. And sugar like you would make a normal cup of juice right so I'm saying this is the unsweetened portion I'm adding water and then sugar and sweeten so the easiest method here is just to sweeten everything sweeten it put it in the fridge and when you're ready to drink all you do is add some water to it and you're ready to go it's like an instant damsel juice you have there instead of having to make the whole thing when you're ready so you could strain this before you sweeten or you could strain this when you're done because sometimes these sugar tend to have little particles in them so i decided to strain everything after the fact so once it is done you drink and enjoy and look out for my red cherry demo thanks for watching